Hey, this is Robert with a automotive quick tip. Like, share, subscribe, comment. Thanks for watching. If you have a P80 Volvo Volvo 850 SV70 from 92 to 2000, this is the perfect tire change kit. You want to start off with the Volvo jack that you often find in the cross country Volvos from 99 to 2000. Don't use the one that comes in the 850, it's just flat out dangerous. Because a lot of these cars have bad parking brakes, get you a couple of wheel stops. Put one in front of the front tire behind the back tire on the opposite side of the car that you're jacking up and changing the wheel on. Get you a hazard safety triangle. You could probably get these from Walmart, 10 bucks. This one actually came from Volvo. But you face that in the direction that the traffic is coming at you. The Volvo one is not reflective on both sides. It's only reflective on one side. The kind you buy at your local discount stores, they are reflective on both sides. You have one of those. You want to get a 19 millimeter socket with a breaker bar that's at least 18 inches long. This is kind of critical, half of a yard half of a meter you want to get one long enough that'll have the leverage to break loose the lug nuts in the event that the lug nuts are on too tight you don't want to get a socket that are impact those normally have thicker walls and they often will not fit in the wheel bore an example the volvo wheels this one fits in there if you have aftermarket wheels this will likely fit in there the Volvo wheels will often let you fit a impact socket in there, but the aftermarket wheels, this hole is usually too narrow for impact sockets. So get you a standard thinner walled socket in this breaker bar. That'll let you get those lug nuts broke loose. If you don't have one of these, you can get these T-bars. They are good as well. As you can see, I painted yellow on the 19 millimeter side. Those are good for breaking lug nuts loose, but not as good as a breaker bar that's at least 18 inches or a half a meter. One last item for your tire change kit would be one of these little vests. As you can see, it's reflective. I keep mine under the front seat of my car, so if I ever stop to try to see if I can, I just reach under the front seat and grab it. These things are just a couple of bucks at your neighborhood discount store. Get one of these, keep these in your tire change kit or under your car seat. That's what I think is a perfect tire change kit. Of course, you do want to keep a good spare in the vehicle at all times. Check the tire pressure in that spare at least every couple of months. Make sure it's maintaining air and you should be good to go in the event you ever get a flat tire and need to change it. If you feel that this information was useful, please like it and share it with your social media friends. You can subscribe to my channel so that you will get notifications of future videos that I post. You can follow me on Twitter, and if you need to contact me directly, please visit my website. And if you have any questions, leave them below, and someone or myself will reply to them. Again, thank you very much for watching.